guest speaker Dr. Alexei Krivtsov from the Bank of Canada presented the results of research carried out by himself and Professor Virgilio Mitrigan of the Federal Reserve Bank of Minneapolis on the real effects of monetary policy shocks. The presentation took place at a seminar hosted by the National Bank of Poland in Warsaw on Tuesday. We aim to um, explain uh, different sources for why monetary policy shocks or changes in monetary policy in general uh, may have on the real economy. One school of thought in macroeconomics argues that nominal cost rigidities and not countercyclical markups account for the bulk of real effects of monetary policy shocks. There's two of such sources. One that is due to um, slowly adjusting cost of production in the economy after monetary expansion and the other one is just due to the fact that prices in the economy are slow to adjust regardless of what happens to the cost and our research points to the importance of the latter source which is that it is uh, the fact that aggregate prices are slow to adjust uh, that explains a uh, big bulk of the real effects of the economy uh, from the monetary policy shocks. But the research done by Professor Midrigan and Dr. Krivtsov suggests that counter-cyclical markups are responsible for a sizable fraction of the real effects of monetary shocks. The bottom line for us is that um, in order for um, economic theory uh, to explain uh, the dynamics of inventory in the data, uh, it must be that uh, markups being low after uh, expansion created by monetary policy is an important feature of the data. Dr. Krivtsov adds that one of the implications of the research is a narrowing down of tools available to policymakers in predicting inflation and GDP. Some of the implications are, are, are that uh, among different ways uh, in which monetary policy can affect real economy, uh, certain attention should be brought to uh, assumptions that imply the important role of markups and the fact that they are low during expansions. Uh, that narrows down the, the choice of uh, modeling tools available to policymaker uh, in the effort of, of, of uh, uh, creating forecasts for things like inflation and GDP. So we point out a, a specific mechanism out there in, in the theory.